Okay, right. So, my choice then, my livery of choice for tonight is... Mr. Frosty with his GT40. That that is my my uh, my choice for tonight. Primarily because of the extra detail that was on the sides of it. I do love I do love the minis, and it was a very very close call for my personal between Genesis, H Boss, Sailboat, but uh, ultimately Frosty is uh, Frosty's got my caught my eye tonight with that one. There's a better look at pole position while we're here. Right, so Frosty is our pole man. My pick for the deliveries for tonight. I imagine someone's honking a horn there. Looking at you, sailboat. One lights, two lights, three lights, four lights, five lights. Lights are gone. Let's get the 1960s retro mod on. Look at Radioactive Goat just belts around the Audi Sport there. Coming on song with, Miss, with uh, Frosty at the moment. Good grief, the straight line speed of that thing's incredible. He's just left everyone standing. All right, H-Boss is in third position now. We've got Mr. Audi Sport coming in fourth. H-Boss is on... Uh, H-Boss, bleh. Ah, oh, dearie me. Jerry's up to fourth now. We've got Sailboat in sixth. And the two minis of Ge Genesis and Fallen, seventh and eighth position. Radioactive goes off in the dirt. That's going to give Mr. Frosty a bit of an opportunity for first position. He takes it. H-Boss has come along song now. He's gone up the inside and taken into second position. Radioactive goes dropped to third. We've got Mr. Audi Sport that's looking to make amends for the poor start. It's dropped down into fifth. We've got Sailboat sixth. Jerry's up to fourth now. Everyone's rocking and rolling. Everyone's very, very tightly strung together. Right? Only 1.2 seconds. Covers pretty much the entire... Oh, no, 2.2 seconds. Sorry, it's covered the entire field. We've fallen alarm in the last position of eighth. Genesis seventh. As we see, we can see we got uh, what's his name now? Something to do with boats. Yes, sailboats up into uh, sixth, fifth, sixth position. I can't talk anymore. Mr. Audi Sport chasing him down. We've got Jerry's in fourth position now. He's going alongside Mr. Audi Sport to his left, I believe. I think Frosty's dropped a couple of positions now. John Anderson's a radioactive go off again. Oh, that car's not got very good handling. It doesn't, does it? Mr. Audi Sport's battling along into fourth. Goats drop down to fifth. There we go, Frosty's made it through the chicane as... Oh, there's a bit of bumps between Genesis and Radioactive Goat there. Radioactive Goat's been more time on the dirt than he has probably on track on this at the moment. Right, so Mr. Audi Sport and Jerry are battling for uh, third and fourth position. And with the coming out on top, Mr. Audi Sport. Frosty's gone a bit wide there. He's uh, onto the dirt, back onto the track now. He's going to slot just ahead of the Jerry. Oh, can he hold it? Oh, snip and tuck. Sailboat's coming alongside. Can he make a move now? Can he go up the inside out breaking? It's almost three abreast there. I think a bit of crowding went on there. I think Sailboat's was having a bit of trouble. Tank slap has arrived. Genesis up to fifth position now. Stay Frosty holding on for dear life. Grimacing grip for third position right now. He's got Jerry bearing down on him. Oh, Jerry's going up the inside. There you go, and he's done him. Can he hold him? He has. He's going for third position. He's up there. Right, so we've got Genesis is now tackling the Frosty at the moment. Whoop, Frosty's had a bit of an outbreaking maneuver there, and he sent Jerry to the Shadow Realm. Jerry's in the dirt going sideways. Oh, Frosty, Frosty, Frosty. Frosty's waiting like a true gentleman for Jerry to get back on terms. There we go, so we'll let him take his take his lead. Uh, Llama's up to sixth position now. We've got Radioactive Goat now into fifth. Challenging at Sailboat, who's coming in fourth position now, powering down the spawn of the straights. Genesis is up to third. Started almost up to last at one position. Now he's into third now. He's chasing down Mr. Audi Sports in second position. 1.1 seconds behind H-Boss who's just trying to romp away into the distance right now. We're on lap two out of, uh, I don't know, many, many laps. And if I actually had some brains and some intelligence, we would find out how long it was going to be. Oh, dear. We haven't actually got any lap, uh, lap guide as much, so we're going to make up as we go along. Marvellous. H-Boss, first position at the start of lap three. He's got Mr. Audi Sport currently rocking and rolling behind him, looking to make a move. Three tenths, two tenths. He's going up alongside of him. Just waiting for the right spot in the braking zone. Oh, a little bit of rubbing going on there from racing. Personal best in the sector one there. Genesis is coming on strong as well. And he's up to third position now. So these Mr. Audi Sport and Genesis were dropped at the start of this race, but they've fought their way back up to the front now. Only standing in their way is Mr. H Boss GT himself. All right, but he's got so sailboats in fourth position. He's got another mini of Ford Alarm behind him in fifth position now, chasing him down. 1.2 seconds, 1.1 seconds behind. Following them is Jerry, who's in sixth position now, who's uh, recovered from his little moment with Frosty, where Frosty just gave him a little bit of a kiss into the Shadow Realm. But he led him through, which is all fine. And then we've got Radioactive Goat, who's currently having a bit of handling issues, I'd say, with that car. Fast in a straight line, brilliant off the start, but I think round the bend is definitely going to be suffering a little bit. That could be the dark horse for the Nordic life when we get round to that one track tonight. 
Mr. Rowdy Sports taken H boss. Do we get a replay or are we nuggets? Nope, we are nuggets. He's already done it before the replay. Whoa, it looked like he was airborne there for a minute. Right, so we've got 10 minutes. There we go. So we've got a timer up on now on how long the race is going to be. Lap four. Because these are very, very fast laps. What have we got about another what? 13 laps to go, maybe? The well, H boss is not giving up on uh, Mr. Audi Sport. He's challenging him down. He's the meat between a, a mini sandwich, if that makes any sense to anyone. Mr. Audi Sport trying to romp off into the distance now, trying to make any sort of gap or impression he can away from H boss. Now, H boss has come into a massive attack from Genesis now. Oof, kicking up the dirt, it can take a much tighter line with that mini. Look at that thing on that. He just slides and controls it beautifully. Right in the back of H boss. I think that mini is definitely just a little bit better on the. Uh, tighter corners and also around the handling side of things now. Right, now right, we'll leave these two to battle it out for a moment. Let's drop back a little bit and have a look at Sailboat who's pretty much running his own race on his Todd at the moment in his Batmobile. Six seconds behind Genesis, 4.3 ahead of Jerry who's now in fifth position after displacing Llama who's dropped to sixth and Frosty's still in seventh and Radioactive Goat is still holding station in eighth. Oh, Genesis has taken uh, has taken himself a bit of uh, H boss. Can we get a replay of it? Oh, I think we might get a replay. It's minor miracles. Let's have a look then. So, where are we going into? Is he going to chicane or into the turns? He's going to be into the turns as it goes along. Oh, he's going to go on the outside of him. Whoa, what a manoeuvre that is. Oh, that's a cracking one, that one. Fair play. Brilliant manoeuvre that one. So, H boss down to third. So, we've got Mr. Audi Sport in first position. We have Genesis chasing him down with less than half a second between them. Dropping H boss now. Well, it's a 6, 7, 8, 9 tenths. Now 1.4 off the lead. So the drops, so the two minis are romping off into the distance now, leaving uh, the poor Alpha behind. Bastino, sailboat, still on his Todd, unfortunately. But then again, it's probably a better. At least he can run his own race and not have to worry about anything. As we go back to Jerry, who's in fifth position, getting chased down by Fallen Love. Whoa, Jerry's had a big moment there. Oh, can he, can he gather it up? Can he control it? Oh, it's biting him, it's chewing at him. He's caught it though. Nope, he's caught it. Good driving there. Bloody thing tried to bite it. Whoa, there's a big moment there. Big, big moment. I think the old llama had a bit of a problem there. What happened to him? So he went through. Let's have a look. So what happens? He goes around here. Does he have a tank slap for himself? Oh, he just drifts out. Drifts out. Oh, ricochets off the curb. Keeps his, tries to keep his, no, he takes his foot off actually. Oh, and he just redraws the track and destroys a bit of Jerry. Poor old Jerry. He's got his second visit to the Shadow Realm for the night now. Down to sixth position. Radioactive goes popped up to fifth. Now, Frosty has obviously had a moment because he's still in eighth position, unfortunately. So he's obviously, yes, as we can see, he's just climbing back on there. So he's obviously fell off the track. Poor Jerry. Oh, he's taking a battering tonight, both verbally, livery, and literally. Oh. I think Jerry's bingo cards, uh, Karma's coming back and is biting him strong tonight. As jo Genesis and Mr. Audi Sport are dicing one on one, and then he's put H Boss back up into second position then. Look at this. We've got a three way battle for the lead now. Cracking drive by Mr. H-Boss there. Brilliant. Held back, wait for the minutes to tangle, then picked up the pieces for Genesis. Now he's got to try and close that gap down. 1.7 seconds on Mr. Audi. Oh, he's got Genesis all up in the back of him again. Oh, kicking up the dirt there. That's going to lose a bit of traction and uh, momentum. Oh, can he catch it? Bloody back in squirming on that kind of thing. I think he's just about caught it. Yep, got the traction in. There we go. He's all right. So he's about dropped about a second to H-Boss. So it'll be interesting to see what how fast he can pick that speed up. Everyone else is sort of spread out on track at the moment. Lots of big gaps everywhere at the moment, so I think we'll stick with the top three for the time. We've got seven minutes, just over seven minutes to go on the race. h Boss is holding second position now. Mr. Audi Sport is in first. He does like that position. He does like to lead from the front. And he's away through the chicane. Or death chicane, shall I say. There you go. So, Genesis hasn't really made the improvement. I thought he would, to be honest with you. Given the pace and the ability of that mini, look at the thing down, look at that down the straight, it's incredible. That eight tenths he made up on that one straight alone, just by following it, wow. Either that alpha's punching a massive hole through the air, well the mini's just got an absolute rocket ship engine in it. But 11 seconds ahead of Sailboat right now, he's got nine seconds on radioactive code, so Sailboat once again is just killing, chilling time, minding his own business, probably looking at his liveries, singing to himself the Bat Batman song. Na, 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 sailboat. Anyway, I digress. So Genesis, third position. Eight tenths behind H Bottom in turn is 2.1 to 2.3 seconds now behind Mr. Audi Sport. Although that gap is sort of uh, pivoting up and down quite a bit at the moment. First position now. 
so I can get a quick sip of water. There we go. Right, two seconds for Mr. Audi Sport ahead now. H Bus is still battling on. He will not be denied. He will want to get that first position back. He's by tooth or nail, he's going to go for it. So look at the lap time comparatively now. So we've got Mr. Mr. Audi Sport. 19s, 18s, 19s and 18s comparative to Mr. H-Bot. What if we missed, everyone's missed it tonight? It's a 19, so he has got a bit more of a bit of a pace advantage on uh, on H-Bot. There's Audi Sport there, Mr. Audi Sport. So what about Genesis? For the fastest lap currently, 117.8. And the 21 and the 20, that's probably courtesy of the, uh, the dirty air, unfortunately, which he has been probably suffering a little bit. I mean, the Mini is pretty small, so he should be able to wince his way through. As my controller disconnects there for reasons unbeknownst to itself. Uh, where's ba where is he? There he is, there's a sailboat now. He's just on his own, really, running his own race. He's probably a bit bored. A radioactive ghost now made his way back up to fifth position now. He managed to curve the handling issues of that car that he's, uh, that, that he's been experiencing. He's able to get on board and get it on terms with it, and he's able to keep it on track. As I say that, it does look a little bit twitchy in the bends, that thing does, to be fair. Right. Fallen, I think that's going to be Fallen Lama, is it now? Six position, he's got eight seconds on Jerry, who in turn's got seven seconds on Frosty. What's that? Everyone's all dropped towards the back of the field at the moment. Everyone's still dicing at the front. Yeah, Mr. Audi Sport is romping off into the distance now. I think H-Wise is either going to have to settle for second position and go defensive because Genesis is all over at the back of him at the moment. One little slip. Let's have a look, see how much time he breaks up down his straight. There's seven tenths on a previous lap. Look at it, it just drops. Seven, six, four distance it just a bit of a longer strain that mini would be absolutely deadly oh no h boss has gone off about a moment about a very very big moment let's go and see if we can check him on board so what happens so he goes down the main the uh pit straight there brakes turns oh, i just understeers on him oh no so he caught the uh caught the uh the tarmac luckily on the outside and genesis is away Let's put Genesis into second position. h boss back down to third. Oh, no shenanigans. Oh, poor h boss Got three minutes and 30 to go. Lap nine. Luckily, t fuel and tire wear isn't going to be an issue. He's on side. He's on par with Genesis now. Whoa, Genesis is in the dirt. Leaving his body some room. Maybe a little bit too uh, too polite on that front. That's how he's good. Hage boss comes alongside his goal. Oh, oh blimey, they're bouncing all over the place at the moment. We definitely get a bit of a lax bike there. Whoa, Genesis has had about three big, massive moments there into the dirt. Four moments now. Just about catching the curb. That's given Hage boss a bit of a reprieve now. He's got two, nearly three seconds on Genesis now. So hopefully, what are we at? Three minutes left, so we'll probably maybe get three more laps. That might just be enough to secure second position as long as he doesn't fall off again. As I see, Mr. Audi Sport is just coolly and calmly with his racing green mini battling his way from the, on first position. He started right down the order, to be fair, actually. There was dropped pretty almost to the last position now, and he's actually fought his way back with the first, and he's holding it onto it lovely at the moment. Look at this flying through the bends. Whoa, what happened there? Did the H-Boss fall off again? He must have, I think. Some of his times are really down. See the mirror up there, there's Genesis just belt alongside of him. He's up to second position. Yes, she holds second position. So Genesis has gone from moment to falling off, then he's caught back on track, then H boss has fell off, then he's caught back up with Oh my goodness. Everyone's falling off and getting back on track left, right, and center. I can barely keep up with it. So H boss, second position right now. Four sec uh, four tenths behind uh, ahead of Genesis, six point three behind Mr. Audi Sport. Genesis currently holds fastest lap at 117.878. Looks like sailboat's still rocking and rolling. Uh, Radioactive Goat's actually closed up his lap times on uh, on sailboat. I wonder if he's had an off somewhere on track, maybe, because that's a, quite a deficit to have been dropped, actually, a couple of laps. 3.5 seconds there. Whoa, big moment there. Oh, dear, that's going to give Radioactive Goat a sniff of it, and he don't need much of a sniff. Genesis and Genesis has taken H-Boss. Oh, they're going to dash again. Can they make it through? Just about. Oh, there comes the rocket ship that is radioactive goat. Straight line speed of that thing is enormous. As we 
see we've got Genesis and HBOS are still battling for second position right now. Looks like Frosty and Jerry and Fallen are pretty much in the whole line of stern. We've got about less than a minute to go. Let's just double check on us. So we've got Genesis, we've got about two seconds on HBOS to drop to third position now. Mr. Audi Sport is still holding first. As time's going down. Genesis has definitely got the pace, it just keeps falling off track, unfortunately. Oh, look at Sailboat, he's wringing in the neck of that car, trying to keep it on the keep it on the grey stuff. Oh no, no, too much ringing. Oh, it's giving it to Radioactive Goat, it's fourth position, Sailboat's my after second, settle for fifth now, unless Radioactive Goat falls off. Oh no. Right, so it looks like we're starting our final laps, so there's going to be 13 laps for some, 12 for others. Let's have a look. Mr. Audi Sports is rocking now. First position got Genesis in second. Is mm, can't quite live with the speed, unfortunately. Hayes possible. Oh no, he's had another moment. Oh, big, big bang attack. There he goes back on track now. Radio actually goes, which has been given like time and positions everywhere at the moment. Back at the fifth now. It's fourth, sorry. As uh, Salvo's dropped out of fifth, they've got Fallen. Currently in sixth position. Well, we've got a battle between uh, for seventh position between Jerry and Frosty. Now, oh, they're touching. A little bit of a handsy handsy for friends there. Oh, this is proper, proper dice. Look at that. Left to right, right to left. There comes Death Chicane. Just got to get a line of stern through there. There's no overtaking on that spot. It's just far too narrow. They're on their final laps now. I think Jerry's going to take seventh. Is he going to have him? He is. Done. Right, who is going to come home in second and third then? I think we're going to have Mr. Audi Sport. Genesis and HBOS, I think that's going to be our finishing order by the looks of it. There's a big gap between Genesis and HBOS now and Mr. Audi Sport. Credit to Genesis, though, that he's got that time down to almost sub five seconds then. Mr. Audi Sport's coming down the pitch straight and across the line. Boom! First position. Genesis is going to come home second. Yep, and then it's just HBOS. A little bit of a wobble out of the uh, final chicane there. Comes home with a very, very respectable third. Lovely jubbly. There we go. I've got a controller. Right, your race results for race number one are as follows. First position, Mr. Audi Sport. Second comes Genesis, who has the fastest lap of a 117.878. HBOS GT comes home third. Radio Goat fourth. Bastin, Bastino, or Sailboat is fifth. Uh, Fallen, sixth. Stay Frosty, seventh. And Jerry brings us home for eighth.